Hello everybody, welcome to the Season 54 first round match between Jay Leave and Engelbert Hex. Um, Engelbert Hex down about 700 TV <laughs> to get Hubris and uh, Eldril and a Wizard as inducements. Uh, a pretty run of the mill Dark Elf team, a pretty unbelievably amazing Chaos team for Jay Leave. And in the booth is Dimmy G the champ. Hello. Hello. Yeah, so yeah, that's a hell of a chaos team, isn't it? Incredible. Look at that warrior. Strength 5, tentacles, 4, stand for 4. And a blitz as well, flip me. I wonder if this one should have gone tentacles instead of guard. That's interesting, isn't it? I might have gone tentacles there. So only got the one full claw bomber uh, with tackle as well. But just, yeah, just in general, like having two strength five tentacles would be pretty amazing. But with two strength fives, you don't need guard. Right, Chaos don't need guard that much anyway. In general. So yeah, I'd have gone ten. I'd have gone ten somehow. Yeah. I know I would have. Tackle on the edge five. Could just lose him instantly. Doesn't look a dog. Look a dog, really. Just exposing. Just exposes like edge five blood with a four dice of tackle gets away with it. And that came on. <laughs> Are you playing fumble, Dimmy? <laughs> Dimmy's gone so yeah. So fair enough, the pill gets a skull, and now it's, I mean, this was already, you know, not a great matchup for the, for the Dells, being down so much TV, and he's keeping, he was, so he's keeping Eldril off, off the pitch on purpose to uh, use him on defense, but now he's lost his offensive drive with a blitz, and uh, now the incessant killing will begin. <laughs> Because it, it was it was the Delves drive. Yeah, but he doesn't want to, he doesn't want to lose him, so he just wants him for the second half. I think that's quite reasonable. I think that's quite reasonable. Keep him. He won't have to protect him, does he? Just leave him off and uh, hope he can get your drive done. Without him. Put him for defense. I assume. Jerry won the toss and chose to kick. Because I would have wanted to kick and then use Elder and the Wizard to get the score as soon as possible while I had 11 players. Wow. Indeed, do I, indeed. So, this, I mean, it's, it's horrific for Engelbert here. Getting two defensive drives and now he doesn't have Elder for one of them. <laughs> it's pretty rubbish. And there's an argument just to lie down already, right? Just run away, defensive Daka. But that's hard because of the tentacles. He really just doesn't have anything. It's literally so hard. This is horrible. How much tackle is there? Oh no, yeah, Dimmy can't. If you can hear me, we can't hear you. <laughs> Hello. Hello, Dimmy. Were you muted? Oh, yeah, I was muted for ages. I said loads of really cool, funny stuff. <laughs> I was like, 
like top quality banter. Oh, I've forgotten it all though. So. <laughs> I get there is only one tackle. There's just not a lot of dodge on the Dells. Oh, that's enough. Five, five or six dodge. Oh, oh, hang on, we missed. Oh, he re rolled it. Oh my god. Got Mr. Page Enthusiast. <laughs> yeah. Dead, dead, dead. Jay leaves a bit like, uh, you know, a bargain basement version of Mr. Page. Who said that? Me, just now. That's a bit harsh. <laughs> Why? Mr. Or it's a super compliment. I don't know. It depends whether you're ready or not. <laughs> exactly. Mr. Page isn't bad at all. I mean, the the ball carrier could have been in a cage, but isn't. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, to be fair, he's probably fine. <laughs> he's probably fine, but he could have been in a cage, but isn't. I mean, the ball's just the distraction, isn't it? Like, he wants to just bang. I'm gonna one day this. Oh, oh is that hubris? Yeah, hubris. Yeah. Oh, uh, he's pretty good, isn't he? Yeah. Whoa, he's really good. Yeah, good boy, Hubris. Oh, yeah. Flipping tentacles. This isn't a bad recovery here from a uh, Engelbert Hex. I think I. <laughs> I'm not going to say that, but, uh, you know. Good. That's close. He can go with a pommer. Mm. I'm wondering if we're going to see a cage this turn either. I don't think we will. Maybe the elves on the floor. No. Oh wow! So the strength for Agi uh, Agi for Beastman is the ball. B word. <laughs> Like because he's got an edgy fire on my neck. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> yep. That's pretty ridiculous. To, uh, this is a cage of sorts. Is he fouling? No. Yeah, he's definitely fouling, yep. With who? With the warrior? Oh, he's right there, yeah. Sorry, he was hidden behind the wrestle logo. So. Uh, I won't get to the cards. Let me. And yeah, that's works. pretty good. So no, no perms yet for... Uh, oh, and the, in comes the fireball, tempted by all of these players. I don't know about that. Well, he, he, he's got the hip, he's got he's got a hoover's back as well, so 2D, <laughs> that's true. On the sideline. This is all Yeah, right. but like, yeah, what? but you like... Does he you not, just do, maybe he doesn't know that hoover's has strip. Oh, he's got show hands, oh my god, I'm an idiot. Yes, Jim, you are an idiot, I can confirm. But also, he should have still blitzed with Hubris because that was a GFI with the other guy, and he could have just blitzed with Hubris and not had a GFI. So Hubris was still the guy to blitz with. But I don't know. I, <coughs> I don't know if that was the Wiz, to be honest. I think maybe that was. Uh... I mean, it was five players, right? And he might have got lucky. Yeah. yeah, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, you're, you're coming from the the Rick logic. Yeah, there's a lot to be said for it, honestly. There is a lot to be said for it, because you're going to have, like, you've got two defensive drives. At the end of the day, you've got two defensive drives, right? Like, there's no way back from this. You're looking at being losing this game 2-0 right now. And so this this could give you the defensive swing to make it 1-1 and get to overtime. So, like, why not go for it, you know? Well, you and could make your, your, your opponent paranoid about a wizard for 14 turns. Or you could spunk your load in two seconds and then they don't have to worry about it and then they can just play however they want for the rest of the game. Yeah, but if you if you if you make them worry about a wizard and then save your wizard for open ladder when you lose, that's not a very good strategy, is it? Yeah. But like I mean you're going by the fact that you're gonna cast three guys out of five. No, just you need something. You need something to happen this drive, otherwise you lose two nil. And also, Eldrill might be able, like, you've got to turn him over once, right? You've got to turn him over once to, to draw. And to win, you've got to turn him over twice. So the wizard, like, is one of them, and then Eldrill is maybe the other. So I, I, I like the wizard there. 
I actually liked it. I mean, it wasn't a good time to use it, but it was the only time to use it. That's the thing, right? That's the thing. It wasn't a good time, but it was the only time. Is it the only time he could just run away and then use it to score on his drive? Well... Maybe I'm watching too much fumble. Maybe I'm watching too much uh, negative strats. <laughs> I mean, it, it wasn't a good use, but, you know, what's he going to do? Second half and he's got six players left. He's going to wizard then, is he? He could just run away, couldn't he? Uh, the DP's the problem, like, obviously, getting fouled. I mean, off. he could run away and lose 2-0, yeah. <clears throat> well, he's going to lose 2-0 now anyway, isn't he? Yeah. Exactly, but I mean... He's damned if he does, and he's... Using well, he's damned... Gave him the chance to not lose, though. Hmm... But I mean, like, there might be a blitz or something like that. There might be a kickoff event on the halfway. There might be space cadet ball protection. Yeah, there might be. There might, might be. be. Might be. I mean, we're, we're all clutching at straws. It is. This is the horrible thing about Blood Bowl 2 in this format is that it can literally end on a kickoff event like that. And, uh, like, now he's just getting smashed to pieces. His wizard's gone. The game is over. Right, and that's it, isn't it? Like, unless something completely like he does a 1D there and double skulls like happens which he did but he didn't double skull um, so God, <laughs> it's over Jim it's over this game's over already though uh, well you can't say it's over because it's not over but no. it it looks over to me and I am um, I've seen a few quite. I've seen quite a few games of Blood Bowl. Yeah, it's pretty much over. Yeah. It's looking desperate. It's very desperate. Yeah, like Kerry Katona. Whoa, that's really desperate. <laughs> <laughs> that's why mums go to Iceland. <laughs> <laughs> setting up a 3D, is it? This is, this is, yeah. No. A fun and interactive oh, hour of Blood Bowl for uh, Engel, Engel, Engel. I didn't, I didn't like putting in to just for all of them, at least you don't have this time. Nice. <coughs> like there's so few players left. <coughs> I mean, yeah, I was, I was going to say, as hard as it is to score against four elves, um, it's still that hard. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> things can happen. Oh, you rerolled it. Oh my god. Just so you could get a 1D on Hubris. Oh, it's a 2D. Right, there we go. Mm. He has left the back door open. Oh my god. Um, well, I guess he's strength 4, yeah. It's not that open. Like, he's got. He's, no, yeah, he's no. Got wrestle, he's, but he's also on like, the five tentacles. Yeah, we're, we're clutching it. Uh, well, strength 5 dodging off of tentacles isn't actually that bad because it is a strength roll, so it's what, a 6 plus, I think, or something like that for the dodge? It's an 8 plus. I mean, if, if the strength 5 is the one with the tentacles, that's, it's, you know. Yeah, but then it's the strength of the player dodging off of it as well. Yeah, which so 7 great. plus, 7 plus, right, okay. Oh, 7 for the strength 4, yeah, but the strength 4 can yeah. the ball. Oh, okay, sorry. Mm. Apologize. It's okay. Right, Actually, yeah. incorrect, Timmy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'd, I'd just rather have gone forward last turn to make this turn, you know, easy. And, uh, yeah, because it's really it. hard at the moment, Jim. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, this, uh, this, this very difficult turn. <laughs> well, you know. Do I? <laughs> yeah. Are any of these elves coming back? Let's have a look at the uh, bench quickly. Two cars, three kids. Oh, he's got he's got a loner and he's got. Oh, Eldrew was coming back at least. Yeah, yeah, Eldrew. Eldrew was saved for the defence. Oh, he didn't put Eldrew on. Oh my god. I don't know about that. Well, he thought he was going to get an offensive drive. So yeah. Going to keep him for the defensive cars. So he wasn't. Same for the defence. So he wasn't Kazuo. 
I think so is that is fun. that not another reason to save the wizard though? Because then you can fireball, and then if the then you use Eldra as the backup to hypnogaze something, if it doesn't go well, like is that not an argument for that? Or? It is, yeah. Obviously, having Eldra and a wizard gives you a really good chance of turning Eldra. But then there's also a, you know there is the argument that you're not going to get a better chance. Yeah. Like, I'm not saying it was an amazing wizard or anything, but I just don't think there's any point criticising it because he's completely... I'm not criticising it. I, like, I just... I wouldn't personally do it, but then... But, you know, I, I mean, if all the... would have played every single turn differently to how he played. Oh, yeah, we all would. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah we all so would. That's the thing. So. I don't hate... I didn't hate the wizard there. That's all I can say about it, really. Like, it, I thought it was fine. You know, he, he, he realised that he had to high roll. And he tried. So. Yeah, yeah, I think that's fair. I think that's a fair assessment. Yeah, fair dinkum. Oh, lovely chain push. Look at this pro mm. play from Jay Lee. Lovely. Yep. And even if it had been a push, it would have had the uh, extra hit as well. On Amazing. Three, so, yeah. Maybe should have taken the, the push so we should have caught him out of it. He's savage. <laughs> What a terrible play! He didn't take the push. I thought, like. Has this been a fun interactive? It's been fun interactive for Jerry. Yeah, I bet. Yeah, I bet. He's like, oh, yeah. Oh, this is fucking amazing. <laughs> Not so fun for a uh, single guy. Angles. Two KOs. He's gonna have like seven. Oh no, he's got a fair few. He's got nine Ooh, now. Nine players. On defense, mm. no wizard against an Agi five, <laughs> an Agi four, and a shit ton of gold. Yep. I think I would have put three warriors in the LOS. Gone total enemy blitz. Which is nearly what he's done, isn't it? Yeah, it's close, it's not. A million miles away. Might be what he actually does in the end. Well, we never know, Jim. I, I think we're gonna run out of time before we find out. <laughs> 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 oh, oh. <laughs> oh my god. Is this tilting strategies? This is like fumble four minute timeout. Sort of. like, what the hell was that set up, Jaylee? Oh wow. Oh that my is the king. god. Flip me. I fought by clicking. <laughs> Was you learning Latin <laughs> while you were clicking? <laughs> <laughs> a nolly think, a nolly think is zero thinking, and uh, all the clicking's done in like three seconds. <laughs> no comment. <laughs> there were literally too many clicks there for it to be nolly clicking. Not, not, not nolly would have had that sorted in three seconds flat. No, glory. Maybe it was. I, I think what it was is he was setting up in a way that was Morse code for Amazon's will never win chalice. <laughs> yes. To, to counter Nolly's team pick. I think mean, that's. So if you go back and watch it in slow motion, it's literally Morse code of Amazon's will never win chalice. Wow. Yeah. Wow. How fucking. How fucking disrespectful. Is this? <laughs> This is full nolly. This is this is full nolly brain now. Wow. That's a bit That's iffy. Especially with Eldra on the pitch. <laughs> oh, he blitzed the wrong one. He blitzed this guy so that people can come through. No, he just wants to claw from her for some reason. I think he might have given up and just been like, oh, I, 
And this way, it, I mean, there's the Dodge non tackle this way, but like, maybe this is like, I'm gonna try and kill you, Claw Bomber. Yeah, and he could, but he could have, could, yeah, could have dodged through for the tackle, but blitzing this guy was better than just coming through and molested also. Awesome. That was a good sidestep on the ball. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, okay, now it looks like saving the wizard was better. <laughs> Oh really, Jim? Oh wow, yeah, sorry. But I wouldn't yeah. have expected this to happen, you know? I but mean, then maybe it wouldn't have happened if he still had the whiz. This is my point, and my point exactly. But then this gives him a better chance, right? This is the thing. Okay, so you spunk your wizard so your opponent's a moron. <laughs> and, then, and then you pounce on the mistake. But wish yeah. you had your wizard to get you to spunk it. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know about the handoff, J Leaf. You need to, like, like win the game first. Maybe handoff and turn 16 when the Dark Hills don't have a scoring for it. Yeah, maybe, eh? I mean, like, that's, like, I mean, that might just be a crazy fall. I'm not sure. It doesn't matter. You were gonna. Pa I know you're gonna pass, but that's even worse. <laughs> that, that's not a defence. That's just even worse. <laughs> I mean, it probably won't matter anyway because he's got AG five, so he can just pick it up in any tackle zone and walk away anyway. It should, it should be fine. Doesn't go for that. Goes for the. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Oh, fails the dodge of tackle. Yeah, another reroll gone. Oh, equity. Flip me. Oh, he's got two reels. This guy had to do a two plus, four plus, yeah, two plus, three plus, four plus, three plus, two plus, two plus, two plus. <laughs> Maybe Eldrill could have gazed one. Maybe Eldrill tried. Yeah, maybe should have done that first. Ah, oh, so Eldrill goes and gazes this one. And then he comes around for the assist. Yeah, okay, that's, that's better. If it was possible. No, because this guy was here, so it wasn't possible. So that'd be the guy. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't, know. I don't care. It's over. <laughs> Thanks the red great total fierce. I feel a bit sorry for Engel, but <laughs> Yeah, it's stupid, right? Seven hundred TV uh. down and then you get blitzed on and don't get an offensive drive with like uh. a bit of a shit dark elf team. Use your wizard brilliantly and everyone slates you. <laughs> I didn't slate him, I just said I it wasn't the wizard turn for me. But like yeah. I mean like, you, like you've obviously thought about it I think, differently. <clears throat> um, which is fine. Yeah. It's blood bowl. We were allowed to uh, see things differently. We are indeed. And then we'll find out six turns later that Dimmy was right. We will. We won't. Oh, joking. We won't. And a lot, of, yeah. a lot of people agreed with you. A lot of people, like a lot of people, agreed with you that the wizard was crap. But uh, I don't. Well, like, yeah, it's not crap, but it's, it, like, mm, it's difficult. Yeah, I mean, I see your point, but uh, I just disagree. <laughs> like, actually, probably, uh, I don't know. Like, I would have won. I would have maybe even whizzed on like the first turn, right? Like literally on the first turn. Oh, I bet you would have whizzed your pants there first turn, yeah. Just, oh. Yeah, I might have just literally just used it instantly just to get it back and get it under control and get an offensive drive. Which is fair. I mean, there is an argument for that, like definitely. And I, I can see that. I think I would have just run away and just let him score and then. Yeah, running, run away, and then, but then you, you run away, then you don't get the one turn chance with, with uh, El. I nearly said El, <laughs> which sucks, doesn't it? But yeah, you, you're not going to stop him, so just run away. It's just rubbish, isn't it? It's just really rubbish not getting an offensive drive. Blood bowl, though, isn't it? It's just blood bowl. Yeah, it's just blitz, isn't it? It's shit. <laughs> oh, it is in, it is in uh, 
crap. Oh, sorry, I mean CRP. <laughs> yeah. 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 Whereas he only would have been able to move like four players and use no skills had it been 2020. I mean, he could have set up better against the Blitz for sure. But um, even if he'd set up better against the Blitz, it would still end badly for him. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like when when you're in this sort of matchup, like you need to be the lucky one, right? You got <laughs> you can't be the unlucky one in this sort of matchup, like yeah, exactly. when you're that far down. Yep. But somehow, <laughs> as if by a, a miracle, he's got a 2D on the ball. Yeah. Uh, what the flip? With oh no, it's not one two, is it? It's one. Put yeah. pals in. With tackle, it's got a scoring. Oh, that's, yeah, that's got a scoring threat. <laughs> oh yeah. my god. No way, man. Yeah. Oh. Where's that going? Oh, oh, yeah. Three. Okay, two tackle zones. It's not bad, is it? Could be worse. I mean. Wait, why is he not going for it with him? <laughs> this is weird. Looks like he's going for overtime. Double ones. Double ones. Nice. See, that's, that's, that, see, that was my argument for using the Wiz in the first half, because you've got Eldril, like, if you get a shot, you might get a shot in the second half through Eldril, which he did. So, using the Wiz in the first half gives you, like, the most match equity, I think, right? Because that actually gives you a chance to end the first half 1 0 up. And then use Eldril to like go two nil up or stall out the one nil, right? Whereas if if you don't use the Wiz, then you're definitely going in one nil down. And while you will definitely have a higher chance to end the match one one, like you know turn him over and that, but then but then you know then you're going overtime with like probably not a team. So it's you could also you could also go into overtime with a wizard. <laughs> you could, but it's really unlikely that you do. It's really, right. unlikely, All right. it's really uh, unlikely that you turn him over without Just my logic, Jim, sorry. No, no, I know it is, but it, you know, it, it is really unlikely you turn him over without a wizard. It is. But you might. I just I just have less and less time for holding on the wiz now. Match five with a ball. Easy to get one D on him. You can see a 1D on the ball. It's literally super easy to get 1D on the ball. Hello. Yep, here we go. Hello. 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 <laughs> oh, my computer went a bit funny. <laughs> Alright, I thought you liked saying hello to like, you know. <laughs> A member of your family, and that's why I was like, I'll ignore him. <laughs> oh, right. yeah. I'm purposely ignored because I just thought you you must have been saying hello to somebody else. Never mind. Hello. <laughs> hello, Timmy. <laughs> well, you don't expect somebody to say hello halfway through commentating a match, do you? <laughs> 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 I thought maybe you'd got a text message from Calcium again. <laughs> oh dear. Alright, well now it looks like... Oh, now he's going for the handoff again. Has not learned his lesson. <laughs> this is so disgusting. It's Mind you, once the bomber... He wants the pommel, Jim. It's pretty disgusting. Like, honestly, if he didn't do that, you'd be like, I would have handed off to the pommel. <laughs> no, I like, wouldn't. You would. You so would. I would not on the first turn. Not oh, on the first right. turn, but that one there you would. <sighs> maybe, to be fair. Where's Eldril? Mm, maybe not. Well, if I knew Eldril was going to double one, I would. Nah, with Eldril there, I probably wouldn't. I would have gone, gone the other side of Eldril, maybe. I'd have gone the other side of Eldor and handed off to him. You'd have been like, I can't believe he didn't hand it off. Oh my god, Four, what's he five, doing? Six, seven, eight. Like, I would have gone here and then handed it off so the Eldor couldn't get me. Oh, so now we are admitting that we would hand it off. Yeah, yeah but not there. 
not there, where Eldred can just can just gaze you and win you the win your opponent the game. To a handoff to somebody who's like basically defenseless. Right? He's got block, hasn't he? Yeah, but the witch elf's got wrestling. Oh yeah. I mean, it's Chalice Equity versus Match Equity, right? Yeah. I mean, the, look at the hand. How much better is the handoff this turn? So, so you'd still be looking at like a one. You could have done the handoff this turn, and then you one in, you one in nine, and then one in nine the next turn as well. So, like, it's so much better doing it this turn. When the game's won. I mean, the first turn handoff was <laughs> ultimate disrespect. Wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, it really was. Yeah, yeah, that was horrendous. <laughs> yeah, it was hilarious. It really was. Like the equivalent of that on tabletop, is you just getting up at half time, packing up a massive greenie, and just gobbing it <laughs> on his like best painted model. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. Absolute brutality. Please enjoy your turn. <laughs> <laughs> Does he go for the pass? Yeah, I wouldn't. I would take the guaranteed piling on. Well, if he kills, if he kills the scoring threat, then he can do what he wants. Doesn't matter, game's over. Trip oh, ho, ho, ho. Use the rear on the trip skulls. No, you definitely don't go for the pass. Yeah, and I guess you do want XPP on the sky as well. Anyway, so yeah. yeah, to be fair, the pass was pretty decent. <coughs> like, Just no not on turn one. Game. Not on turn one when it's the only chance your opponent has to disrupt you. <laughs> like, the only turn you're not going to be in a cage. The only chance the elves have. Not, don't do it then. <laughs> <laughs> do it then, because I will really enjoy it. <laughs> comedy mega. Absolute comedy mega. Yeah. It yeah was. So this, this is what I was gonna say like earlier on, like when I realised what I was gonna say and stopped myself saying it. I was like, I can see why Engelbert Hex is now playing fumble. Because <laughs> 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 he's just like, this is fucking bullshit. Yeah. He didn't actually take that much damage, but then there, there wasn't many tackle, right? There was only tackle on the claw pommel. Um, well, I'm saying like the Blitz, isn't it? The Blitz where yeah, you can just blitz. move your whole team. Yeah, like, the Blitz was just stupid. Like, it was just, yeah. it was just game. It was almost In a game that you need to be pretty lucky in as well, like, yeah. from the start. Yeah, 700 TV down. Ish. And then instead of Jay Leave showing a bit of leg, he showed his full nutsack. <laughs> <laughs> like, Jay Leave went full OnlyFans on it. <laughs> 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 then he just failed everything. Full OnlyFans. <laughs> <laughs> wow, it made the, made the tight LOS. Oh, it's 2-0 up, okay. Yeah, yeah. Geez. That's good. That's that's good to do the tight LOS, right? Because that encourages your opponent to go for a go for a one turn. If, a completely you know, pointless one turn. A completely turn. pointless one turn. But it does encourage them to go for it rather than punch you guys more effectively, right? Anything that encourages your opponent to go for the to go for a one turn is good. So not like this was absolute quality play there from Jaylee. You can see similar quality play in my uh, Era BB League match. I, uh, I do the same thing of uh, putting my guys together on the list. Unfortunately, I, I meant to leave a hole in the back line and <laughs> like forgot. <laughs> <laughs> it's just surprising because you like coined that, didn't you? I did, yeah, yeah. The gaping yeah. ghoul defense. It was actually a time to use the gaping ghoul <laughs> defense, and I didn't. I was good. <laughs> A defence that you've been practising for many a year. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> there you go. Amazingly enough, the size of 28 V bricks beats the one with five. Uh, outrageous. But, yeah. I believe it, Jim. Yep, there you go. Loads of removals. But yeah, the main thing was the Blitz, right? The Blitz just made it. Just made it over instantly. But, um, there you go. Um, 
congratulations to Jay Leave, commiserations to Engelbert Hex. Thank you very much, Dimmy G. Glorious having you in the booth. Yeah, it was uh, it was good having you in the booth as well. <laughs> well hey, <laughs> thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.